Hello learners you are watching video on Hermione Squad a group of literary students initiative if you are new to this channel please like share and subscribe so here comes the age elizabethan age elizabethan age is the time period associated with the reign of queen elizabeth i and is often considered to be the golden age in english history This period of time is remembered for its richness of poetry and drama especially the plays and poems of William Shakespeare Many people regard Shakespeare as the greatest playwright of all time His plays and poems are still performed and studied in Britain and other countries Elizabethan era was a brief period of internal peace between the english reformation and the religious battles between protestants and catholics historical background the elizabethan age was the time of many developments and was considered as the golden age in english history the great developments that happened during this time can be partly attributed to the leadership of the queen elizabeth the first Unlike the many eras where there were many battles and struggles for power across Europe, this era was relatively peaceful. During this period, literature, English poetry, music and Elizabethan theater was also coming out. The literature during Elizabethan time was not only appreciated by the upper class, in fact, the lower class equally appreciated William Shakespeare's literature and drama plays The dominating features of the period can be conveniently summarized under two heads settlement In politics the English nation was attaining to a state of stability dynastic problems though still nerve-wracking did not cause open warfare and the union of the crowns finally set at rest the ancient quarrel between Scotland and England the settlement was all for the good of literature expansion in our history this is perhaps the most remarkable epoch for the expansion of both mental and geographical horizons now knowledge was pouring in from the east and new worlds were opening in the west The great voyagers whose exploits were chronicled in the immortal pages of Hakluyt brought home both material and intellectual treasures from beyond the still wax birth moors as Shakespeare called them. It is unnecessary to enlarge upon the important effects which these revolutionary discoveries produced in literature. Queen Elizabeth Elizabethan period began in 1558 when Elizabeth I became the queen and one of the most popular monarchs in English history. Queen Elizabeth I was a Protestant. She re-established the Church of England as the official church in England. She succeeded in finding a balance between the views of Catholics and the more extreme Protestants. In this way she avoided many serious religious conflicts within England. Queen Elizabeth is sometimes called the Virgin Queen, Gloriana and Good Queen's Bess. Elizabeth was the last of the five monarchs of the House of Tudor. Elizabeth had an older half-sister Mary Tudor, who was the king's first child with his first wife. Elizabeth also had a younger half brother called Edward. Elizabeth and Mary were declared to be illegitimate as their father sought to pave the way to the throne for Edward, his male heir. Elizabeth ruled for 44 years from 1558 until her death in 1603. Elizabeth took a moderate approach to the divisive religious conflict in her country. 
Elizabeth never married or had children because she seemed to have no interest in sharing power with a spouse. While the end of her reign had been difficult, Elizabeth is largely remembered as a queen who supported her people. Her lengthy time on the throne provided her subjects with stability and consistency. Her political acumen, sharp wit and clever mind helped navigate the nation through many religious, social and governmental challenges. Elizabeth died on March 24, 1603. It is believed that she died from blood poisoning caused by toxins in the heavy makeup she wore. Queen Mary Elizabeth I inherited a number of problems stirred up by her half-sister Mary. There was also great tension between different religious factions after Mary walked to restore England to Roman Catholicism by any means necessary. Mary had earned herself the nickname Bloody Mary for ordering the execution of 300 Protestants as heretics. Literary Features The first one is New Classicism or Renaissance. Classical languages like Greek and Latin force themselves upon the branches of literature. But the new classical influences were of a great benefit as they polished the earlier roughness of English. Pamphlets and treaties were freely written and literary discussions slowly grew in importance and frequency. New Romanticism The romantic desires of the remote The wonderful and beautiful were nurtured during the Elizabethan era, which can be considered as the first and the greatest romantic epoch. Development of drama is another literary feature which had to overcome many difficulties in the Elizabethan era. One was the closure of theatres between the years 1590 to 1593 Despite all these difficulties the theater managed to reach splendid consummation especially for Shakespeare Poetic production was of great and original beauty even though it wasn't as popular as drama Prose also rose to a position of first rate importance and was acquiring a universal application writers of the age writers such as shakespeare marlowe spencer and sidney wrote the finest poetry and drama that went on to influence writers all over the world for generations to come this is all about elizabethan era we will be back with our next video on jacobian age